I'm never making deliveries in the hood again, okay? If you know, you know. Hey y'all, this is Mrs. Jackson. So I've had a uh, pretty busy summer with my daughter and everything, and um, I decided to do DoorDash and Uber Eats. This summer, being that I'm a stay-at-home mom, I do have a couple of uh, businesses, watchoutwigs.com and Ranger Miles Apparel on Etsy, Shameless Club. Uh, but anyway, <laughs> for those of you that, that have DoorDash for a while, I don't know how you can get through hundreds and thousands of door dashing uh, deliveries without getting a contract violation. So after 179 uh, deliveries, I made it to my first contract violation. Yay, yay, woo. Okay. <laughs> Let me just say something. I'm never making deliveries in the hood again, okay? If you know, you know. I'm only going to make deliveries in the nice, rich neighborhoods. If you know, you know. Hey, you, you can call me uh, bigoted if you want. You can call me whatever you want to call me. I'm serious. So I accidentally accepted a uh, McDonald's order this morning. Okay, I usually avoid those. I usually avoid those, but my butterfingers thought that the accept button was a decline button and i pressed it i said oh lord here we go i already know i, I just knew something was gonna be uh my, my gut just know right so it was like a five dollar order and uh like for three or four miles whatever you know what i'm saying i and it, it was way out my zone the zone that i wanted to be in right i went ahead and uh got the uh mcdonald's order and I handed it to the uh, customer, right? So the, the customer name was actually a female's name, but a guy came in the front door. I mean, he was sitting there way in front of me. He was sitting there way in front of me, like handed to me, like, oh my goodness, okay. You know what you think it's gonna do, run away? The reason why a lot of scammers want you to hand them the order is, is to prevent you from taking a picture. And being that I'm introverted like that, I really don't like to take pictures of the food while, you know, while while they're actually there in, in the process because it just kind of feels intrusive or whatever. But uh, baby, he snatched that McDonald's like it was the last meal, like it was the last McDonald's meal on earth, right? So I'm like, okay, whatever, you know. A couple of hours later, I get a contract violation talking about they never got the order. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So yeah, of course I disputed it while I was doing Uber Eats at the same time because I multi-app, you know. Uh, the, re the, 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 the rest of my day was pretty good. I ended up uh, accepting a $20 Aldi order this morning, which didn't even take an hour to do, hey. You know, I made more than $20 that order for that one hour. So, I mean, I, overall I had a great day. It was just that one, it was just that one order that I slipped up and accidentally took. I knew I shouldn't have did that because I just knew that the order was going to be bad, and I knew it was going to be on some scamming stuff, okay? So, yeah, this is actually one of my first uh, videos that I'm actually talking about DoorDash. I've been DoorDash since July of 2023, and I've actually been DoorDash with my daughter for the most part, you know? Um, we usually do, like, four to eight, you know, five to eight, do a few hours a day before the sun goes down because, um, being a woman with a child trying to DoorDash after dark, I believe, is not safe. So sometimes when my husband gets off work and comes home early, I will leave her home and I will then go and DoorDash uh, or Uber Eats then. Or when her uh, grandmother watches her, I'll go and DoorDash like right after I drop her off or whatever. Okay. But man, it's like it's no avoiding it. You're going to always run into a customer that don't feel like paying for their McDonald's food. Like, if you broke, just say that. If you wanted some free McDonald's, just say that. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> anyway, this is Mrs. Jackson. It is hot than I don't know what. The devil done farted today and left his stinking breath out today. Uh, let me see if I can show you how hot it is. See that? 102 freaking degrees out here today. 
So my air been on blast all day. I really don't like to blast the air because you know it takes it takes gas away. And you know when you door dash, that's all you do. You spend money on gas. But anyway, that's all I wanted to say. I'll keep you guys updated with everything else.